I just lost my phone. Did my bed. I had my phone in my hand. Afterwards, I couldn't find it. I checked under the sheets. It's not there. I checked my pockets. It's not there. I have my denim collection for you guys today. I have so many pairs of jeans. I have a ton. So many. I actually don't wear some of them because I don't really think they're the most flattering on me. At the end, I'll let you know which ones I'm selling. I'm trying to clear out my closet category by category. So I'll be doing like a whole series of like these collections. It's like my trouser collection. My shoe collection will be coming. I'm going to start with my favorites. These are from Zoffel. For reference, I am 5'2", 110 pounds. I'm usually like a 24, 25 for jeans or size zero. These are probably one of my favorite pairs of jeans. They're just like so comfortable, soft. They're really flattering, I feel like, on the waist and on the butt. That's what it looks like. It has like this little rip here. It's just like super lightly distressed. They're the perfect length for me, which is super rare since I'm short. It's super nice all the way through. I have no complaints about this. They were pretty inexpensive. Oh, and I got this in a size small. These are actually the only pair of white jeans that I own, but I am so glad that I have them. They fit like no other pair of jeans I've ever tried. They're so tight around the waist. Not in an uncomfortable way, and you just know that it's like creating a waist for you. And I feel like it just gives my hips a nice shape. These are from YesStyle. I got this in a small. I would size up in it because it is a little bit tight for a small. They also have like, these little elastic bands on the inside. So if you size up because you want to have a looser fit through like your hips and your thighs and you have like a smaller waist, you can still adjust it and it'd be perfect. And I just really like these jeans. They're just so nice. See what the back looks like. They're so flattering. It is really good quality denim actually. It's like pretty thick honestly they also come in different colors one of my favorite i love the shape of these jeans they're just wide all the way through but they're super super fitted on the waist so i don't feel like i'm gonna slip out of them these are from pretty little thing the quality of this is really good i remember i was doing a haul from asus and i got some top shop jeans right after i got these and these are way better than top shop jeans they also have this big hole in the back which i really like I know it's controversial, but I think it's super cute. Also, again, just the shape of these jeans. Look how it makes your waist look. Look at that. Yes? Okay, I got this in a size 2. Only thing is they were really long. I just cut off the ends of it, so that's why they're frayed like that. If you're 5'2", you're going to have to cut these. But if you're taller, these might fit you perfectly. And like, oh, there's just so much to love about these jeans. I love how they look. Mm. This is what the butt looks like. For a loose pair of jeans, these are really flattering on the butt because they kind of have like this seam that just goes up the middle and it really separates at the bottom so it looks like you have jeans. Okay, next we have these Levi's. They're more like a tapered fit, so they're kind of like a mom jean really. They are the wedgie fit. I don't think it makes my butt look that good at all. Like. I expected a lot more. I got these in a 24. They're just like regular jeans, I feel like, and I... Haven't worn these in a while. I feel like I need to keep them just because they're Levi's and I spent so much money of them. In like high school when I bought them, they were like 50 something dollars and that was a big deal for me. These are my other pair of black jeans. They're really cool, they're from Shein. I got this in an extra small, but like this is what the waistband situation is. It's just like two buttons like that. Super baggy. I really was so into this and I still am. I, don't know. I feel like I don't photograph that well in baggy jeans, but I really love baggy jeans. They're so comfortable and I think they make you look like you have a lot of shape. My favorite part is probably the waistband on this. It's like super interesting. It gives you a little V shape so it makes your waist look smaller. Also, they fit pretty nice for a pair of baggy jeans. They're not too long on me. I mean, wear like sneakers or boots, it looks perfect. That's what they look like from my view. I think they look so good actually. I love the shape that it gives any outfit. It's definitely one of my go-tos for like the fall time or the winter time. It's just such an easy pair of pants to put on. You feel super comfortable, but it does add some interesting looks to your outfit. Here's the next pair. They're from White Fox. Another pair of baggy ones. The slits are very simple. They're just like cuts across. And I got this in a small. But I would probably size down. It's not loose around the waist. I'm like okay with this. I don't need a belt or anything. It's just 
They are really long. My box in general, their pants are not meant for short people. I just really like how the shape of the legs look. Like they're kind of poofy. But they still like taper a bit at the end. So I really like these. I think they look good with sneakers. Like some high top white shoes. These are another one of my favorites. I don't really wear it that often either because I feel like I just stray away from jeans. But if I did have to pick some baggy pairs, then it would probably be this one or the black one. The quality of these jeans are also really, really good. They're really thick. This is how it makes your butt look. It doesn't make it look amazing. I don't really care. They're just some baggy jeans. As long as it looks good overall in the outfit, it goes with anything also. Like, it goes with baggy t-shirts, crop tops, like whatever. Yeah, I would say these are one of the must-haves. These are from Brandy Melville. I have two pairs. This one and the ones I'm going to show you next. These used to be so like fitted on me because I used to be kind of chunky in undergrad. Now they're unfortunately quite loose and I don't know if they make my body look as good anymore, but I used to be obsessed with these because they made my butt look super popping. They just have like a really nice straight like look to it. These are classic. I don't think I can ever give them up. One day, baggy jeans are going to go out and mom jeans are going to come back or tapered fit jeans are going to come back and I'm going to want to have these bad boys in my life. These are 100% cotton. It doesn't tell me what size I got them in, but I'm pretty sure these were like a small, medium, large type of deal. And I think I got them in a small. Yeah, these are definitely small because my mom was like, why didn't you get them in a medium? You're not small. And I was like, I think so. They also fit my leg length really well and they're not like cropped or anything. So I don't know how they did that. I feel like they still make your butt look really good though. Even though I have lost a lot, it has still, it's still doing magic back there. These are the other pair from Brandy that I was talking about. They're very similar, but these are lighter and also five button fly. And I feel like it's just more relaxed through the leg. But looks like I think it's still pretty flattering. This doesn't tell me on the pant what size I got them in. If I had to guess, I would say small because I think these were also in the small, medium, large category. These are also some basic like classic must have jeans. I don't know if they sell them anymore though, so I feel kind of bad talking about them because I did get them like five years ago. You can't go wrong with these. You can't go wrong with a pair of straight legs. So I will try to find these for you guys and link them below. Here's the full body. And also these are great for short people. Again, awesome length for me. At 360. These ones are from Shein. This is a split hem situation. It fits really nice like lengthwise for me. It's really strange around the thighs. Like it's really tight right here. But then loose like in the crotch area so something about the sizing is just weird for me i got this in an extra small also i just really like how it makes your butt look your butt looks really good in this so that's why i kept it and they're a really good length for me like i said so i can't really complain it's just like the crotch part kind of bothers me it's a little tighter on my thighs so i would have sized up i think that would have helped but i'm not sure about the crotch situation this is one of the things where you just gotta like try it because for different body types it might work these are the other pair of split hem pants that I have. These ones feel a little funny. I do love that it's brown. It just looks really great in monotone outfits. But the only thing is, I feel like it gives my leg this weird shape to it because it's not baggy or like wide enough on the bottom. I found this in the petite section in Boohoo. And they do fit my legs look really well. They're just also a little bit loose. Yeah, this is a size two. I probably should have gone for size zero. I don't know. These are one of the pairs of pants that I also reach for a lot when I go out just because they're very soft. Maybe it's not the most flattering, but I do like the color. They have a little bit of like an acid wash like type of distressing on it. Also, this is how it makes your butt look. Which I feel like it makes your butt look really good, actually. This is the other pair of brown denim that I have from Shein. They're more of like a tapered cut. They're not straight leg, which is strange because I never really go for that. It's better when they're rolled up and worn with like boots or something because they kind of just don't have any shape at all. They're a bit like gypsy pants, but I do like them. They're just different from like all the pairs of jeans that I do own. Like it really feels like you're wearing sweatpants. That is an extra small. It is really nice and fitted on the waist. Does not make your butt look good at all. Not going to lie to you. More classic pair of straight leg jeans. This is also from Shein. It fits very well. It does not make your butt look good. Okay? I'm telling you that right now. It doesn't make it look bad, but it is not really doing anything for it. However, the fit and feel of it 
I just feel so safe and comfortable in these. I don't know, they just hold me in right and I just feel like I'm meant to be in these jeans. They're also perfect length for me. Don't know how that happened. This is what the butt looks like. They're just regular, you know? Okay, I got this as an extra small. These are just like a good pair of straight leg distressed jeans to have. Oh, I didn't zip my, oh, maybe that's why this is looking funny. That's what they look like. Full body view. I think they're really flattering. These are a solid pair of jeans if you're trying to get some straight leg. And if you're 5'2, like these will be the perfect length. Perfect length. This pair is also from Pretty Little Thing. I was actually thinking about selling these until I put them on, which I haven't done since I got them. I literally have not worn these. This is what they make my legs look a little funny. They are like this really nice patchwork look. They look super cool. I just don't know if I'm like a skinny. I'm not sure I'm a skinny jean girl because I don't have the shape really for it. I feel like maybe if I wore them with boots, I would like them. I feel like it doesn't do anything for my body. It also is extremely oddly high and higher in the back than it is in the front. So I think that might be because I don't have hips slash a big enough butt. But I love the patchwork on this, so I'm a little torn. What do you guys think? Do you like them? Should I sell them? I think with boots, you know, they would flare out the end, so at least they'll give me that kind of shape. These are also in a size two. I feel like I'm not gonna gravitate towards these just because they're skinny. I feel the denim on my legs and I don't like that. Now I have this super random outlier. This is from Drillishy. It was a very um, random collab I did with them. They have like these chains on the side. It's like a whole exposed situation. I think they're really cool. I just have never worn them because I don't know if, I don't exactly know where to wear these two. Just that I'm I'm a little hesitant to actually wear them. They are like the perfect length for me. They honestly might be a little bit short. I got this in a small. They're not like super tight at the waist or anything, which I think I would have liked. I think it would have made it a little bit more shapely. These are pretty thin. They do make a lot of noise in the washing machine though. That is annoying. This still has this tag on it because I want to sell it because they, I feel like I can't cut these. These are from Pretty Little Thing also. And this is how long those like baggy jeans with the rip on the butt look were on me and i don't think i could just like cut off the edge of this and make it look okay but these are so cool i love the swirl pattern on them it looks really really interesting and they are a really nice baggy fit they're just way too long for me i don't know do you think i could pull this off and like make it work because if so i'm gonna try it i feel like i'm gonna need to wear these with some really platform platform sandals i got these in a size two i could have gone for a smaller size i think that might have helped they're really thick jeans like i said their little thing jeans are actually quite quality i wanted to show you guys because i thought that these were really cool and if you're like a little bit taller then these might be perfect for you honestly the more that i wear it the more it grows on me i feel like i could Pull this off but i don't know if i'd ever be able to take a picture of this outside because i would be dragging these all to the ground but maybe indoors i could take a picture and make it look intentional you know maybe i have decided on selling these jeans little patchwork jeans from pretty little thing size two these with the like side things i'm gonna like try to take a picture in them but i'm probably never gonna wear them out so i'm gonna sell these they're gonna be like ten dollars to so check my Poshmark and these jeans just because like they're cool but they're too big for me. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you like and subscribe, and I will see you in a later video. Bye.